From a state trooper in Utah that tried to make an illegal U-turn, and a freak accident in Thailand that blanketed the road in a cloud of dust, to a wave of wet cement that covered this driver when he stopped short of a truck, and much more. Here are some of the craziest worker mistakes caught on dashcam. Concrete has done wonders for the human race. We use it to build all kinds of things, from tall buildings and bridges to sidewalks and road barriers. But a bunch of wet concrete in the wrong place can lead to some serious headaches. Just ask this driver who decided to stop short in front of a cement truck. The next thing he knew, he was hit by a wave of wet cement. The best part of that clip is after the windshield wipers come on. The man stands there looking at the truck driver like it's his fault. Maybe he should have cleaned off the back of his car before driving away. Something similar happened in China when two drivers randomly stopped in the middle of the road. Both of them got the concrete shower they deserved. Mixed cement is still pretty heavy, about 3,900 pounds per cubic yard. It's not like getting hit with mud or dirty water. In fact, it looks like the concrete wave was powerful enough to blow out the back window of the black SUV. Take these videos as a learning lesson. Don't stop short in front of concrete mixers. In fact, don't stop short in front of trucks in general. Krabi, Thailand is a small city about 400 miles south of Bangkok. Like most of southern Thailand, much of the economy relies on tourism. Still, plenty of blue-collar workers keep things rolling behind the scenes. Take this delivery driver, for example. On February 16th of 2020, a flatbed truck full of dry cement was heading down a rural road in Krabi. According to the driver, he swerved to avoid an older man crossing the street. What happened next nearly covered an oncoming car in cement. You can see the flatbed truck coming around the turn. It tips ever so slightly, causing pallets of dry cement to slide off and explode in the street. The dust cloud envelops our car, and a few blocks crash into the front bumper. Our driver and the trucker met at the police station to figure everything out. His company agreed to pay for any damage. He was also hit with a small fine for careless driving. As for the elderly man crossing the street, nobody knows what happened to him. The next time you're at a gas pump, count the number of safety warnings printed all over the machine. Most people look at those warnings and think, who could be that stupid? Well, you'd be surprised. A woman pulled into a gas station somewhere in frozen Russia. It was so cold that the end of the pump froze, meaning no gas was coming out. So she pulled out her cigarette lighter and tried defrosting the pump. What happened next should shock anyone. Sources say this happened in the Siberian city of Surgut, where temperatures can drop below minus 27 degrees Fahrenheit in the winter. There's also some confusion over what she was trying to do. Some say the pump was frozen. Others say she was trying to check the gas gauge and needed a light. A few think her gas cap was frozen and she was trying to melt the ice. Now, what she was trying to do doesn't really matter. At the end of the day, she did the most idiotic thing imaginable, strike a lighter next to a running gas pump. Now you're supposed to slow down or pull over whenever you see emergency lights. Whether it's an ambulance, fire truck, or police officer, emergency vehicles need to get places as quickly as possible. That means high speeds, going through traffic lights, and pulling quick U-turns. It was the 4th of July weekend in Morgan County, a small community in northern Utah. A man was driving his pickup truck behind a state trooper when the police car's lights suddenly came on. His GPS must have told him to make an illegal U-turn. Some news outlets were quick to blame the pickup driver, but as you can see in the video, he had no time to react when the officer pulled in front of him. The officer veers right as if pulling over. That forced our pickup driver to cut left to get around, at which point he was doomed. A statement from the Utah Highway Patrol blamed the officer and vindicated our pickup driver. They said the trooper failed to observe the traffic behind him. The driver of the truck directly behind the trooper was unable to avoid the collision. 
Huizhou is a prefecture-level city in Guangdong Province, China. It's home to about 6 million people and one very unlucky driver. On August 16th of 2023, a local couple was driving along when they saw someone tailgating a semi-truck. Look at this psycho, they must have thought. But when they got closer, they realized what was actually happening. By some miracle, the driver of the trapped car was rescued without injury. There's no telling how far the semi would have dragged him if not for our heroic drivers. And we're not sure how this accident happened in the first place. Did the driver hit the truck, or did the truck back into the car? Seeing how the car was running, we're leaning toward the former. The semi was probably stopped when the car crashed and got stuck. The driver never even felt it. Semi trucks like this have a lot of blind spots. In fact, most semis can't see 30 feet behind them. This driver could have dragged the car for miles. They'd never see or hear it. Chengdu City is the fourth most populated city in China. With nearly 21 million people, Chengdu is bigger than LA, New York, and Chicago combined. In a city that big, you can expect some pretty rare road accidents to happen. On March 7th of 2017, one of those freak accidents occurred. A black SUV changed lanes without looking, which forced a silver sedan onto the shoulder. That caused a delivery truck full of bricks to veer right and onto the sidewalk. Then, gravity took care of the rest. Thankfully, our truck driver was more concerned about the sedan than his bricks. He raced over to help unbury the car. Watching the video back, it's pretty easy to tell who was at fault. Everyone is coming to the same stoplight. The black SUV and silver sedan are fighting for a spot in the same lane. It doesn't look like either had their blinker on either. Every year, distracted drivers cause hundreds of thousands of car accidents. While most people agree that it's a problem, not everyone agrees on the definition of distracted. According to the CDC, anything that takes your eyes off the road, hands off the wheel, or mind off driving is considered a distraction. For example, removing your sweatshirt is a super distraction as it ticks all three boxes. On May 4th of 2022, this trucker learned that lesson the hard way when he got a little too hot in the cab. You can tell right away that this driver knows what he's doing is wrong. He inches the hoodie up, trying his best to keep his eyes on the road. Meanwhile, his passenger just focuses on the window. He's either totally oblivious or doesn't want to say anything. It's game over once the hoodie comes over his head. It gets stuck, the driver starts to panic, and their truck veers off to the right. Our passenger braces for impact while the driver never sees the trees coming, literally. To make matters worse, it doesn't look like either were wearing a seatbelt. Luckily, both men walked away from the accident. The driver was unharmed, while the passenger only sustained minor injuries. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to click the link on screen now to see another just like it. With that, thanks for watching, and be sure to tune in next time.